Hi YouTube, hope everyone's well. Um, in this video, I want to talk about how, how I've managed to play internet radio on my amplifier. Um, as you can see, it's a Yamaha RN500, which is a good few years old now. I think I bought this in 2015. And up until a couple of years ago, the network radio feature used to work really well. Um, however, as, like I said, as of two years ago, they've now started to charge for this feature. It's not much. It's $3 a year, I believe. However, that's not the point. Um, it used to be free, and I've just been looking at al alternative ways of getting um, music on here. So what I have is a Synology NAS. Um, and as part of the NAS, um, I've got an app called Audio Station which actually has internet radio built into it. So I'll just head over to the NAS for a second. You can see it through here. Um, just here on the left-hand side, the, the, the tab behind is Audio Station. This is Audio Station, and you can see here we've got internet radio. So I've actually now managed to get internet radio playing on, my, on the amplifier. And the steps I took to do this were in hindsight were relatively quite simple. So really all I had to do was turn, was install um, media server. And in the browsing settings, all I did was enable internet radio. And then um, by default, um, there's a number of radio stations um, already kind of baked into the Synology software with the option for you to add more, as long as you can find the M3U um, link. So what I'll do now, you can see here, we've got alternatives, blues, classical. If I head over to, um, let's just say jazz, um, you can see there the first one is jazz groove. So if we head back over to, to the amp, if I now change it to server, it will find multiple kind of sources on, on the network. So I've got my laptop, I've got my Synology NAS, and I've got my Vodafone router. So if we just head over to the Synology NAS, uh, click on music, change this to internet radio, uh, favorite stations. Actually, if I just go over to jazz, which is what we were looking at there. So they're all by Shoutcast. So there's a jazz and you saw the first one was jazz groove. I can see that here. Click OK, and it'll take about six seconds for it to play. There you go. But it does play, plays quite well. Uh, so let me just change that before I get done for kind of copywriting. Um, so yeah, all, all this was was enabling, uh, well, installing audio station, installing media server, and then just enabling the internet radio. I can now because this is now connected to my NAS, um, any music that I have on the NAS also will will play through here as well. You can see there's various um, there's various folders there. Um, got a lot of Indian music that I listen to. Um, and in terms of credentials or user permissions, there weren't any as as long as the the amp is on the same network as your Synology NAS, it does the trick. So hopefully this helps someone. Um, please like if you do. Cheers.